Hello and welcome back to the next Good Game Empire video. I'm back from my summer trip, so I'm back to regular recording and live streaming. Of course, live streams every Sunday at 9 p.m. CEST. And now I'm with the video about two new events which are here because of the Good Game Empire 10th anniversary. Uh, yes, this game was created on in August 2011. So now we have um, already 10 years after the game creation and we've got two special events to celebrate this um, like this step, this 10 year anniversary. So we have basically a LTPE event uh, which lasts for one and a half months. Uh, so it's basically called Grand Anniversary Party and it's all about the 10th uh, anniversary of Good Game Empire as you can read here. Uh, we also have the updated uh, event schedule which is as they uh, say is back to working so it should be correct but about the event we have uh, plenty of better than usual re rewards so as I said it's uh, half more half longer it's for uh, 45 days originally uh, instead of 30 and we have way better rewards both for the tops and for the rewards for points so starting with the top rewards now, now we have top 500 for every uh, server we have a inner district and 500 upgrade tokens for top 500 players which can uh, get into these positions uh, we have for top uh, 250 we have a decoration grand anniversary banquet uh, which gives you 3.4 thousand uh, public order and looks pretty nice as a anniversary decoration I will love to have it in my castle to be honest and 250 construction tokens but the main point of this event is the top 10 uh, reward which is the um, keep uh, the appearance item for the keep so what it basically gives you is plus 250 unit limit on the wall but where's the time where's the remaining time of this item well there is no because this is a um, the permanent item so you will keep it for uh, for all the time there is no uh, temporary time you keep it for yourself and it gives you plus 250 which is the basic uh, amount and then it gets multiplied by your castellan bonus and also uh, if you have the appearance item for your castellan plus uh, the bonus from this appearance item which can be 250 multiplied by 1.7 which is around 400 something 440 i think so it's around this number and it's really insane because it's permanent you keep it for uh, forever and you can switch it bit, bit like um, between your castles it's very op and uh, we also have 500 seats for the top 10 reward which is also a pretty nice reward yeah so that's the first uh, part of this event it's for tops and we obviously as usually uh, collect the season points so we have also rewards for season points but uh, we don't get gold pieces we get anniversary tablets so um, uh, first we have um, we have the first um, part of these rewards and to complete the first part we need to collect 2000 points and we, it will uh, in total give us 8100 points of this uh, this anniversary tablets yeah and the second part unlocks when you finish the first part so when you get to 2000 points you unlock the second part which is the three next uh, pages so you need to collect in total up to 10,000 points and you will get uh, 9,250 points for the uh, second like part of this. So in total you're gonna get 17,350 of anniversary tablets. And what can you do with these tablets? They are uh, also very useful because you can go to Master Blacksmith and here you have a third tab uh, with anniversary tablets where you can spend them for very nice rewards. So basically you have um, 12 options here and uh, the free uh, the first free which I um, don't recommend you to buy uh, them because it's just a waste of this uh, currency. So we have horse tails, skips and veteran horrors, don't buy them. Um, the second row is the most interesting because we have seeds, upgrade tokens and construction tokens. So mm, the best items to buy here are uh, construction tokens and seeds. Because we can also get um, the or, um, decoration, which gives 3000 public order. But the price for this is nearly as much as half of the points you can earn in this event. Maybe there's a third part, I'm not sure, because usually there was 100,000 points to collect in this event. So maybe there's a third part and we can get even more than 17,000. Uh, but I'm not sure. 
But anyway, uh, spending 7.5 thousand of this currency is not worth it. Just don't buy this decoration. Also, I don't suggest you to buy any affluence tickets nor any other uh, reward here, like in your district or this. Yeah, this is also not that worth it. This is a uh, temporary item, so also pretty useless. Uh, the best option here is construction tokens and seeds. And if you're not sure which one should you buy, then I would go for seeds if you don't have any uh, research in your Hall of Legends on uh, going right now. So if you uh, need some more seeds to start a research, then buy seeds and start it. But if you already have a research going on in your uh, Hall of Legends, then I would go for uh, construction tokens and improve uh, your uh, like relic buildings. So that's the two ways to go in this shop. And we also have a second event uh, for this anniversary of Good Game Empire, which is called Anniversary Party Raid. And this is a collector event, you probably know them, but there's also many players uh, who are new to the game and start watching me. So I'm uh, gonna explain this quickly, how does it work? Uh, basically you need to attack other players to gain a kind of currency, which is party balloons uh, for this type of event. It's basically a uh, like um, a type of event which uh, repeats uh, very often, but with different uh, images and kind kind of currencies. So you can see this event with collecting bees or with collecting uh, fur or any other stuff, but it works the same. So the main rule is to get points to get uh, rewards, and at the end of the uh, this event, you're gonna get um, these rewards depending on the amount of your points. And also your points get multiplied by 35%, so you get 35% of the uh, already um, existing points on your account um, every day at um, the, at noon or depending on your time zone. So at, at the time where uh, when your kingdom league resets and when everything the, of this uh, kind of uh, resets. So uh, how to collect these points? You just need to find a player who is uh, about your level or maybe like 200 legendary levels lower. Obviously, if you are not legendary level, then you can attack anyone who's uh, higher or a bit lower. But if you're high legendary, you need to search for a player which is this type, I know, 3000, which is, yeah, uh, just above your level. And you can send a special attack, which is called, yeah, event attack. So it's next to the attack button. You press an event attack, you can see how many party balance this player has. <clears throat> this player has. And you're gonna, let's set up a, uh, like, Mm, only uh, explanation attack so you can get a basic 5% of what they have you can increase this by boosters but it's not kind of worth it so don't buy them just uh, attack as many as possible and if you manage to get mm, 20,000 in the first day so which is today um, you can get to 160,000 at the end of the day just by multiplying these points over the next days so uh, there is many rewards to get. For 10,000 points, you get a re decoration, 1,250 public order, and uh, some fast, uh, fast uh, favor travels. Uh, so for 20,000, you get a um, permanent commander um, appearance item, but you can't uh, embed any gems into it, and you get some tickets. For 40,000, you get a beautiful, in my opinion, a Castellan look, and a decoration which gives you 2,250 a public order for your castle. For 80,000 points, you probably know this already because it was here a few times before in this event, you can get a custom relic hero which has uh, bonuses to base uh, resource production and to bo uh, bonus to public order, as well as strength for units stationed in outposts and landmarks. So this is useful for outposts. It's not the best for me. For example, I recruit the mid units in parks, so I'm more pushy for the uh, recruitment uh, time bonus. But for newer players and not that advanced players, it's gonna be very, very strong anyways. So I uh, suggest to you uh, to try to get this reward as well as the next rewards, because for 120K points, uh, we get a plus 2000 foot production, which can be swapped for this usual 1100 foot production item as well as a, com a Relic Commander Hero, which gives uh, us later army detection as well as strength courtyard and a horror strength when attacking. So this is basically like one or two silver stars item. Uh, sorry, yeah, it's two silver stars, it's from here. So it, it might be even uh, better. It's random and you also get a one random effect. But anyways, it's very strong, uh, especially for pretty fresh accounts. It's very, very strong. And I 
uh, highly suggest to you to try to complete this event at least for 220k points but there's also a next reward for uh, sorry for 120k points yeah and for 1160,000 points we have uh, five affluence tickets which can be spent in the affluence wheel you can get uh, mid units or if you are very lucky you can get a jackpot where you can win um, for example food uh, build items for uh, food production or uh, units on the wall or even rubies uh, you can maybe win 50,000 rubies as a first level uh, jackpot in this wheel it's pretty low chance but anyways it's worth it to just have a chance to spin it uh, very cool rewards are dropping from this maybe you know if you buy these tickets and if not then it's very profitable for you so that is basically all about the event um, I have a lot of uh, new ideas for videos, so also a PvP series, which was um, like I said it was going to be published like two weeks ago or three weeks ago. I'm very sorry for this. I had my uh, summer trip to mountains and stuff, all stuff like that in summer. So it's gonna be after this video. I'm, re I'm already working on this uh, PvP series, already recorded some parts of the videos. So it's gonna be on days, on the following days. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Sorry for this inconvenience with the, um, the video being later, but they're gonna be uh, very soon. And I also have a lot of plans with other videos because I've got a lot of ideas during this trip, which was very uh, regenerating and you know, you know the stuff. So uh, leave a like on the video, comment if you have any questions. I'm gonna answer every comment which includes any questions or uh, any stuff related to me if you want me to answer, obviously. So I'm gonna uh, get back to everyone who needs the. Uh, answer. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're watching regularly because this also supports me and leave a like, click the bell to be uh, on the time with the videos and see you in the next one in a couple of days. Bye!